Just as you digest food by breaking large molecules into smaller, easy to absorb molecules, pineapples can break down the molecules that make up your cells. In fact, every time you eat a pineapple, it eats a little bit of you. Pineapples contain a very powerful proteolytic enzyme called bromelain. A proteolytic enzyme is a molecule that can break down other proteins. Just like beaded necklaces, proteins are made by joining many amino acids together. Just as you might cut a beaded necklace using a pair of scissors, pineapple has bromelain scissors to break down proteins. Pineapple has two types of bromelain, one in the stem and one in the flesh. Both versions of bromelain digest protein, but they have slightly different structures. In our case, stem bromelain is better at digesting proteins than fruit bromelain. Proteins make up living things. They are the skeleton of your cells, the glue that holds two cells together, and the machines that run your cell. An enzyme that can break down protein will inevitably damage cells. The stinging, tingling pain that your tongue feels when you eat a pineapple is bromelain digesting your tongue as it physically damages your cells. If you eat too much pineapple in one sitting, your tongue might feel like you scrubbed it with sandpaper. Thankfully, the tissue in our mouth heals faster than the tissue in the rest of our body, and saliva comes equipped with natural painkillers. Fortunately, once you've swallowed the pineapple, your stomach acid and your own proteolytic enzymes will break down bromelain. Pineapple isn't the only fruit with digestive powers. Kiwi fruit, another fruit that stings your tongue when you eat it, has a proteolytic enzyme called actinidin. There is also papaya, a fruit that doesn't sting your tongue, but contains papain. Bromelain and papain are also used to tenderize meat, as the enzymes digest the meat's proteins. Muscle, the main component of meat, is largely made of protein. By breaking down the proteins, you're making the meat softer. Leave the meat in those digestive enzymes long enough, and you'll have a very tender cut of steak. One explanation for the high concentrations of proteolytic enzymes is that they might prevent animals from eating the fruit before the fruit is ripe and the seed is ready to begin its life. Once the fruit is ripe, the proteolytic enzymes won't hurt an animal's tongue and will be okay to eat. For example, the proteolytic enzymes are more potent in an unripe pineapple than in a ripe one. Another reason might be that the enzymes help the seed mature. Enzymes play an important role in sending messages to the cells. These messages might tell the cell when to start or stop a key process. Without these enzymes, the seed might not develop properly. Now, if you want to avoid the sting from the fruit's bromelain, simply cook the fruit. Enzymes change their shape when they're heated, and an enzyme's functioning depends on its shape. Break the enzyme shape with heat, and the enzyme won't work. However, if you're willing to let your fruit have a nibble of your mouth, keep eating your pineapple raw.